Hi everyone, I hope you're doing well and I miss you, but I thought it would be fun if we could make a frog puppet together. For the craft, you will need a paper plate, a few sheets of paper, uh, crayons or markers in the colors red, green, and black, either uh, tape or glue, and a pair of scissors, as well as help from an adult. Using either the crayons or the markers, you're going to color the inside of the plate red and the outside of it green. If you don't have a paper plate, you can use a piece of paper and do the same. Color one side red and one side green. Once you've done that, you're going to fold it so that the red is on the inside and the green is on the outside. I'll do that with both. Using your paper, ask an adult to cut out two big rectangles. Once they're cut out, they should look like that. For the next step, you will need those two rectangles and a black marker. You're going to take your one rectangle and fold over the end of it just a little bit. Just like that. And you're going to do that to the other side, or the other one. Now flip these two pieces of paper over so that the folded end is touching the table. Now you're going to draw either a circle or an oval and color it in. And then do that one, or do that for the other one. Once you've finished the circles, you're going to take your glue and put some on the folded part on both of them. Next, you're going to take your uh, paper plate and you're going to put the piece of paper on the top. These are going to act as the frog's eyes. Make sure they're pressed down really nice. If you don't have glue, you can take tape and put it right on top, just like that, and it'll stick down. For this next step, we're going to make the frog's tongue. So you're going to need to ask an adult to cut out a knife or a long, skinny rectangle. So you're going to need the rectangle and a red marker. Um, color both sides red, and when it's done, it should look like this. Now for the last step, we're going to put the tongue in the mouth. So you can either glue or tape it in the mouth and leave a little at the end so that he can catch some flies. Now you've got yourself a frog puppet.